Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 17th of February 2024. I hope you are keeping well. I'm feeling less tired than I was this morning after I did some exercise. I went swimming. Although the pool was very crowded today. It was like you had to swim zigzag to avoid the swimmer jam that was in the pool. But uh, anyway, the exercise has made me feel slightly more refreshed. Which is counterintuitive, isn't it? You should feel tired after exercise. But anyway, maybe I'm not doing it properly. Um, have you ever wondered how Google and YouTube follow you around and make suggestions? I wonder just if it's always listening to what I say. Uh, I've been talking a lot recently about my cat's fungal infection. And uh, I often like to talk about politics in the UK and science. And I was suggested a video by... Uh, somebody, um, I mean, I mean, I suggested a video by YouTube of, actually I've forgotten his name, but I know his first name was Merlin, Dr. Merlin, somebody or another, something with an S, I can't remember what it was, my apologies, anyway, uh, <laughs> he was, uh, the reason I, th this, I mentioned this is a kind of confluence of uh, things that I talk about, he was talking to a UK Parliamentary Commi Science Techno and Technology Committee uh, <laughs> about um, fungi. Um, so I think it's a combination of all of those factors. Google's been listening on in on what I say and has decided that's what I want to listen to. <laughs> it was fascinating, though. It was brilliant. I hadn't even realized before that fung fungi don't even fit into the normal flora and fauna uh, f uh, flora and fauna um, um, phylums, phyla that should be I suppose, uh, it, it's its own phylum um, fungi and uh, it doesn't really work in, in a similar way to, to plants or animals so that was really interesting, anyway the whole thing was really fascinating, uh, it was an, an enjoyable and, and, and good video he was talking about how uh, how f fungi grow and are sustained and what we need to do to continue to keep them sustained and uh, it was really good <laughs> i recommend it check it out dr merlin and that's probably good enough to uh, get you where you need to go uh right but my um sudoku playing skills today don't seem to be up to scratch well here it's a bit noisy outside the factory is about to empty for the saturday workers um but i can get started with a three blocking down did i mention this is the new york times hard level puzzle i don't believe i did so let's mention it now we've got a three in that square there. Well, I can see eight blocking up here and eight across there. So I'm going to get myself an eight there. And we're going to have eights there. And by the look of it, we're going to have eights in those squares as well. We've got seven across here, seven across there, and seven up there. So there's our seven. Need to rehydrate after my exercise i think five across here and five across there we'll put five into that square so that's going to put fives down here and five up there Um, okay, we've got four blocking across it. I don't know, this is, don't know if this is going to lead to anything, but anyway, it's something I can see. We've got fours in those squares, so then four across here and four across here. And I did mention a moment ago, eights blocking here across. So we found ourselves a first pair of four and eight in those squares there. What does it mean? It means ones are going to be there. Threes, I don't know. Fives, I don't know are going to be in those squares 
So, wait a minute, wait a minute. Might be better to do these first of all. Let's see what's missing from here. This is four and eight. So over here we're looking for, not four or eight, we're looking for five. Oh, one, five, six. Okay, and we've got five and six together. So that is going to be a one. We have five and six in these squares here. Okay, we have three across here, three blocking this square here, three across here, so three in one of those two squares blocking back in this direction, and that gives us a three there. We're left up here with two and seven. So seven down here, seven across there, there's a seven. Do anything about twos? Okay, two across here and there, there's a two. So two's like so. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nine across here, there's a nine. Nine's up there. Seven, nine over here. Okay, eight up here. Oh, excuse me. Eight going up there in a straight line, please. And eight up here and eight across there will give us an 8 in this square, 8 across here, across there, up there, and up there means that's an 8. I see the 1 across here and up there puts 1 into 1. 1 is in one of these two squares which is going to give us 1 there. But that's not good enough is it really? Three is going to be in one of these two squares. Does that do anything? One, two, three, four. Three, four, five, seven, three, four, seven. I think that's five, three. I had a disastrously long game this morning, and I won't let this one go on uh, <laughs> for such a, an outrageous amount of time, I promise. I will just switch to pencil marks if it's getting too tough. We have a lot of stuff pointing over here. A lot of things, but there's only one number placed, so it's a lot, it's too much to remember. Can't remember all this stuff, but I can see a lot of things. I mean, for example, we've got one and three, one and three, right? So one and three along the bottom here. I already know this is four and eight, I said, didn't I? So we've got one, three, four, eight, one, two. One, two, three, 
four. Five is in these two squares. What do we know about six? Six is like this, because we've got six over there. Seven like that. Eight we've got, and nine in these squares. Is this, what did I just say? Seven? Is that a seven? Uh, all right, let, okay, it's not a one. I'm gonna have to do it like this. It's not a one, it's not a two, it's not a three. It's not a four because fours are in these squares. This is four and eight, right? It's not five, it's not six. It could be seven. It's not eight because eight is here. It's not, it is seven, okay. Thank goodness. Seven up here, seven up there. That's a seven we can place. That's going to put sevens into those squares. Oh, no, it's not. Seven across here. This was two and seven, wasn't it? I remember now. Um, so this can't be seven. That's going to be seven. That's going to be two. Any more on the sevens? Yes. Seven up here, across, up like that. So there's our seven. That's the final digit, seven. Twos will be in those squares. Mm. Okay, three across here puts three into that square. So now we have one and three blocking down here, right? One and three blocking down here, or one and three across here, or one and three across here. That's a pair of one and three. This is four and eight. And so we are left with five, six, nine in those squares there. We've got nines there, we've got fives here. But the sixes... I'm not sure about still. Okay, what's left up here? This is what? Four, I can't find it. Four, six, six blocking up there. There's a six. And there's the four. I, since I know that's a pair of one and three, I should look and see what goes here, right? Because I worked out this was one. We had remember we had one and three down there and across there, so we have one and three. I didn't see what goes in here. I should look now. Good job I looked because it's five and six, isn't it? And we've got the six blocking there, so that's our six, and that's our five. And thank goodness I looked. Okay, we've also got five blocking down there. That's going to be five, and the last number here is four. Missing numbers in this column, 169, we've got a 1 and 6 together, that then is our 9. And so 9 across here, 9 across there, there's our 9. Uh, 1 up here, we need a 1 in this row, so that's our 1. And this is a 2, I think, wasn't it? Okay, two down here, two up there, there's our two, two across here, two up there, two down there, and there's our two, two across here, and there, and up there, finished off the twos.
six blocks this square here we don't have six in this row yet so let's put it there where it must go and we'll have the nine here to finish uh, I remember this was four eight so when I see the eight blocking that square there I know that that's going to be the eight and that's going to be the four and of course this is going to be the four four across here four up there there's our four four blocking up there there's a four, four across there, four up there. There is our four. Three blocking across here gives us three in that square. Three down here, three across there. There's our three. Oh no. Nearly told you something false. Let's tell you something true. Eight blocks this square. We need an eight there. And we need a one to finish this row. One blocks up there. There's our one. The last number here is a five. Five blocking down here puts five into that square. This number is a six. We still need a six in this block here. Six blocks across here. Six. Six blocks across here. So that's a six. Six down. Six across there. There's our six. And the last number here is another five. Uh, what do we need here? Du, 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 du. Nine is it? I think it's a nine. And we have nine across here and nine down there. So there is our nine. The missing number here is a one. One across there puts one into that square. One down here. Here's a one. Here's a three. I remember. We still need a three. Okay, that's it. Finished. That's our New York Times game. Definitely better than the Guardian I played this morning, which which I found a real struggle. Or just because I wasn't awake or whatever. I don't know. Anyway, that's it. See you around. Bye-bye.